with the banking crisis involving institutions like Silicon Valley Bank, Signature Bank, and Silvergate, investors are swarming to cryptocurrency alternatives. The financial chaos brought on by the failure of major banks has benefited DEX and CEX tokens. Over the previous 24 hours, the prices of a number of these assets have increased, including those of OKB, GMX, DYDX, and GT. Although it's not apparent whether the banking crisis is the only factor driving the price increase, it's generally accepted that some investors are turning their attention to these particular coins. OKB has increased by 13% during the past day, GMX by 10%, DYDX by 8%, and GT by 7.5%. At Finance Doc, we will be sharing more explanation videos related to cryptocurrencies, trading, Forex, and many more. While you are already here, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and click on the bell icon to get notifications for our future videos. So, let's begin the video. After suffering a setback a few days ago, the overall value of the crypto market has seen a significant climb recently. Tokenization-related tokens are among the other types of tokens that are becoming more popular. With a price increase of almost 8%, SNX is a remarkable example to consider. The total market value of the cryptocurrency industry is currently $1.08 trillion, a rise of 5.59% over the previous day. In the meantime, several companies' stocks are experiencing significant losses, frequently in double digits. The majority of these concern banking institutions. Bank crashes create trying times for global market. The previous several weeks have seen the collapse of several institutions. One of the most famous is Silicon Valley Bank, which some believe may start a contagion. For one pound, or around $1.21, HSBC purchased the bank's UK subsidiary, benefiting UK customers. Meanwhile, the Federal Reserve made the decision to close the mainly cryptocurrency-focused signature bank. System risk was mentioned as one of the reasons for the decision by the authorities. Then there was Silvergate, which failed to file its annual report. Investors eventually switched to stable coins as a result of its eventual insolvency. Crypto criticized for the banking crisis. Some in the sector think that the American government's actions against the banks are anti-crypto. This was said by a board member of the Signature Bank, who noted that it was a strong anti-crypto message. Jake Chervinsky, the chief policy officer for the Blockchain Association, is of the opinion that cryptocurrency is not to blame for the issues facing banks. In any case, the government will undoubtedly attempt to impose some sort of market regulation. As the world's markets are in upheaval, Bitcoin and other assets are holding up well. Bitcoin has increased in value by almost 10% during the last day and is currently worth about $24,500. What is your opinion about the banking crisis? Do you feel crypto is the reason behind the banking crisis? Let us know in the comment section below. If you have any feedback for us, don't forget to share that as well. See you in the next video, until then take care and keep investing in crypto. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss out on our upcoming videos.